Hello everyone, I am Prem Kumar. Welcome to Mad J Academy. Today I am going to discuss with you a very interesting question. The number of solutions of the equation. Greatest integer function into the fractional part function plus x is equal to 2 times fractional part function plus 10. You already know that fractional part function range is what? 0 to 1. Right? Strictly less than 1. Okay. Let us take m is equal to greatest integer function n is equal to fractional part functions you can take right now you can substitute it here you already know that fractional part functions equal to definition is what x minus greatest integer function then any x that means any real number you can write as the sum of the fractional part function and the in greatest integer functions we can write here greatest integer function we are considering m and n here is the fractional part function right Okay, now just you can substitute it here. Okay, so you can see here the n into m minus 1 is equal to 10 minus m. That means n is equal to 10 minus m by m minus 1. But you know that n range is what? 0 to 1. n here is the fractional part function. But n is what? In terms of greatest integer function, you can write 10 minus m by m minus 1. Okay, so you can use this range 0 to 1, right? So now you have to solve this equation more than 0, less than 1. Let's take more than 0, you can solve this. You can see I am taking that minus out in the numerator. You will get m minus 10 by m minus 1. So the critical point here is 1 and 10. Then you can use Wavico method. The prod ratio is less than 0 is required. m is 1 to 10. The same way you can do for the right side also. You can see here is... Uh, 2m minus 11 by m minus 1 is greater than 0. The critical point is 1 and 11 by 2. So, we need to find the this expression 0 to 1 means we need to take the intersection of these two, right? You can see the intersection here is 11 by 2 to 10. So, 11 by 2 means 5.5 .5 to 10, which are the integer is there. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 only is possible. Just you can substitute it here. First, you have to write x in terms of single variable. So, I am converting everything in terms of greatest integer function. You can see. So, here is m is the greatest integer function. You can substitute m is equal to 6, 34 by 5 you will get. Same way, m is equal to 7, 45 by 6. m is equal to 8, 58 by 7. m is equal to 9, 73 by 8. m is equal to 10, 10. So, there are 5 solutions is possible. I hope everyone understood. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel. Thank you everyone.